Welcome everyone, my name is Tianji Trendy and today I am going to discuss with you the PS4 DLC's problem and installations. Many of my friends and my followers and uh, fans has been said that they are facing problem with their DLC's and some of the discs they have they bought is not working with their DLC's or any type of problem. So let me come to you this point and I have the solutions for you. So let's get started. So before getting started on this time let me say you that Sony said that their DLCs and the PlayStation 4's this are region free. So this is not the truth. Guys, it's half truth. The half truth. The reason is that I'm just going to show you. So this is the Call of Duty Advanced Warfare and as you can see and it's with the name the education that is more real name. So let's go ahead and hit the store right now. And you can see that I am able to fetch this store. And you can see I can do all the sort of things that I need to do on my store. So this is one of my this is one this is my first account known as Nidish Cash yep. And let's go to my another account that I am just going to show you how to get rid and this is the and the trendy and let's get into it. Okay, so before starting this uh, I need to close the application because it's been started by the first user. Okay, so let's start the advanced warfare again. Let's get to the multiplayer and let's hit the store again and I'm pretty sure that you would get something really good. I don't know what this happens sometimes to the it's take great time. Okay, so let's go and hit the store. And I know that I'm going to get an error message. So I need to show you guys about what this type of error and how to get rid of it. So let's check. Okay, so this is what I am being talking about. This is what there is no content it might not be for sale yet or might no longer be for sale so what does this really mean so i'm just going to hit the browser on my here well that i don't really use the browser and i'm just going to type oh just uh like open i'm just going to type here Come on. Shit, how big is it? Okay. Okay, guys, sorry for the delay actually. I just missed the term there. Okay, so here is the code, uh, the URL to the website. That is the bit.ly slash tqza. The link is also in the description. If you don't, if you can't see, you can find it on the description, and hit enter, and you will come to this page from the gamefacts.com, and this is the Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. And here, if you just scroll below, you will see that the product ID and there is the codes, the C U S A. So here is the trick that is this this or not totally region free now just let me get to you okay so where is the and uh, just remember guys our is 851 so we need to find the 851 so right now you can you can't see that 851 is here so what does this literally mean so here you can see the call of duty advanced warfare JP means it's a Japanese version AU is an Australian version, EU is a European version, and definitely US is the American or United States version. So the thing is that if you are going to get the disk which has a region code of CUSA00803 or something which is made for the US, then and then and if you are out of the states 
and living somewhere else any part of the country then definitely the game is going to work on you you can play the game offline unlimited of times but you can't play it on the multiplayer or even if you can play into multiplayer you can't download the DLCs the most of the time it happens that you can't download the DLCs the same is the similar cases like if you are in the European or in the uh, Eastern countries like India Bangladesh then you are going to get the European version and uh, and if you get the European versions you need to purchase the DLCs from the European D servers if you purchase the DLCs from an uh, American or Japanese servers then definitely they are not going to install and they will just give you a simple message waiting is to install yes that is waiting to install is the thing that it can't find the the, the product ID code which is actually the um, ID code in, by, by which it installs in your PS4 system and it can't find that particular folder and if it can't find that particular folder then it can't install and it will always it for a lifetime it will show that waiting to install so how to get rid of this problem so here is the solution guys the thing is that I got here two accounts and let me show you what are the accounts so first is the end trendy and the another is the near Kasha. and you can see also a uh, PS Plus subscription is attached with my needed scholarship. So this is my home home countries that is the European Indian world account where if I purchase any discs from India and or the European discs so I'm going to buy all the DLCs from here. Yes basically it's a uh, now you need to remember which are the discs from India European and which are the discs from other countries. So I basically use a sticky notes or something that I stick them to my disc and so I can know that this game is particularly from this country and I need to purchase the DLCs from this country. And here is the Andy Trendy. This is an US account with all the US details no there is no fake details all the details in this account are also correct so means there is no lacking so if you don't have got any details from the US well you can ask for your friends or if you don't then you can use the fake generator which I don't recommend but if you know you if you just purchase the DLC then you can do so just let me say you have purchased a disc from image on eBay and and that this is from the US region then definitely you need to create a US account so you have to come to your US account here and install the disk purchase the DLC and it will work and if it is from your home country then create your home country account and use it just uh, the simple in this case this is the only solution that works uh, if you have got any problem if you have got any queries about what is going to do and not then just leave me a comment below hit the subscribe button and like button I hope you would love, love this like button so that I could bring more and more information about how you get that everything and also I have also made a previous video about six to seven months ago uh, I don't remember the exact date about the same thing but I haven't described how to get rid of it so here are the solutions guys how to get rid of it this is literally uh, I, the simple trick but and also I have tried to contact the Sony support center i have called them emailed them i have done everything but the response was not too good they were even they weren't even unable to solve and also i didn't get my money back so there was no refund as you know these are the digital goods and you can't get refunds quickly well it it may be different in your country or us maybe they are they do the refunds there but not in our country they don't do the refunds here so that's all guys i hope you would love it 